Obi Jones is in as a third receiver. First touch, Arian Foster with a spin move, had a couple of touchdowns in that loss to the Jets last week, a three-yard game. Running back, that's our focus on the Fouts focus. Two of the best in the league today, Andre Arian Foster and Chris Johnson. They couldn't be any different in their way they get their yards. Foster's a downhill runner, makes one cut and goes, averaging 5.2. Johnson's more of a slalom runner as he makes a cut after cut after cut. His career long is 91 yards, no matter how it's shredded up. Effort. The numbers don't necessarily lend itself to that. Little floater over the middle, and Foster pops a big one. Not across the 45-yard line. Arian Foster, so dangerous, through the air. 19 yards on the catch and run. Yeah, Schaub read the safety blitz from Chris Hope. Hope coming, number 24, right up the middle. That leaves the middle of the field wide open for Foster. And this is the type of tempo that the Texans used against the Jets to get back in the three main receivers in the game on a second and nine. Back to Foster. Foster trying to bust it to the outside. He does, walking a tightrope. But he's out of bounds before the first down. Jacoby Jones with a block. He picks up seven. Jason McCourty could not bring him down initially. This is where he's so dangerous when he's got one-on-one -on -one with a defender. It's a good job by McCourty to push him out of bounds right there. His right foot hit on the chalk about two yards shy of the first down. Arian Foster over 1,000 rushing yards on the season. He's played in 16 NFL games, 1,261 rushing yards coming into today. What a revelation he has been undrafted out of Tennessee. And Foster shot out of a cannon, a three-yard gain and a first down across the 45. Five, Houston playing without Owen Daniels again today. A shot, play fake, sells it well. Under Foster did not get drafted and said Houston got themselves a real steal. And Foster has proven that this last week against Foster. And you're seeing why. He's got the ability to always seem to make the first guy miss. The first guy never gets a real clean shot head up on Foster. And he hits the hole so quickly. Third and six. Houston has five first downs already. Tennessee has none. Shaw. Foster looking for a blocker. And he goes down. But a protective cast. Third and two. Shaw. Little out. Foster. The fake and leap. Arian Foster doing some extra work after the catch. It'll be first and goal for Houston. Tullock could not bring him down initially. 16 yards on that pass play. He showed you just about everything he can do as a pass receiver on this outlet. Good decision by Schaub. Watch the shrugging off the middle linebacker Tullock. They picked up the penalty. Houston takes over with a gift to Arian Foster. Breaking to the second level, and he's got a first down. Blocks up front from Myers and Winston to help spring Foster for a 13-yard pickup. Like uh, all great backs, it starts with vision. Left side run, seeing the hole back to the right side, and then the balance and the speed. Good move there to get inside Griffin, pick up, pick up an extra three. Arian Foster, five 100-yard rushing games this season. Seems to be on his way to another. Ten carries, 42 yards for Foster. Time of possession dominated by Houston. Yards as well. Foster has got a running lane. At taking it to the outside, Foster, his ability to zigzag. Nine-yard. Schaub looking. Schaub throws to Arian Foster. He's got a first down inside the five. He's been doing it all season. And this time it's Vincent Fuller, 22, that can't make the tackle. And then McGrath comes flying over. He can't bring him down. Foster, who's seen two great efforts now to try to get the ball in the end zone. For many, they don't want to leave the Titans with too much time here at the end of the first half. Schaub throwing it underneath the coverage. And Arian Foster only down to 14 seconds left. Schaub steps up. He throws, there's the first down into Tennessee territory. Arian Foster, what a weapon. Arian Foster in the backfield. It's a running play for Houston. Little shake and bake move as Foster crosses over. And as you said, not an eligible receiver on the play. They catch a break on a second and 10. Dump off for Foster inside the 30. On the ground, look out. Arian Foster! Vontae Leach with a block, 18-yard run.
And it, again, it's between the tackles, these wide defensive ends of Tennessee. Good kick out block by Vontae Leach. Super touchdown. From the gun. Job, soft throw over the middle, and it's Arian Foster. First down. Backfield to receive it. Yeah, and he's working on the middle linebacker, Stephen Tullock. Tullock was too wide with his pass drop there. Grabs a hold of uh, Foster's jersey, but not until after he catches it, picks up the first down. 17 to nothing lead for Houston. Three and a half to go in the third quarter. Texans are driving now with a first and 10 at their own 24. Stop and go by Foster. And a four-yard pickup. Foster remains in the backfield. They'll go with the running play. And Foster! Stays on his feet. Arian Foster almost ripped that one. Again, right in this lane here. Texans have made a living today running behind their left guard, Wade Smith and Dwayne Brown. There's the horse collar non been shutting out the Titans 17 to nothing. That Foster bangs under seven minutes to play now. Houston in front 17 to nothing. And Foster spinning his. Well, they're very confident that the chemo will have a good effect on the type of cancer. And that they fence for Houston. 86 for Tennessee. Arian Foster. Flag down. As they needed a win in the worst way after the way things have transpired in recent weeks. Arian Foster, just shy of a 15-yard line, giving a gain of five on the play. And a timeout taken with 3.04 left. Fourth quarter.